TransferWise is one of those genius companies that solve common problems using methods that seem obvious afterwards. It allows you to send money abroad, so they're doing international bank transfers. However, their main value proposition is that it's much cheaper than doing it through your traditional bank. For example, when you want to send $1000 to Europe, traditional banks will apply a fee of around $50 but TransferWise will only take about $10. So how is this possible? Well, TransferWise main innovation was inside the process part of the business model canvas, especially the key activities. They managed to offer such low fees because money never actually leaves the country. Let's say that you are in the United States and you want to send $1,000 to a guy named Emmanuel in Europe. So you place that transaction on TransferWise. But instead of crossing the border, your $1000 will actually go to an American account belonging to TransferWise. Now, somewhere in Europe, there's a girl named Angela who wants to send 1000 euros to her friend called Donald living in the United States. So she does the same. She goes on TransferWise, but her money in euros goes on another European account belonging to TransferWise. Then TransferWise will simply send the 1000 euros from Angela directly to Emmanuel and your $1000 directly to Donald in the USA. Of course, this example is very simplistic. I didn't even take the exchange rate into account, but you get the basic principle. The money never actually leaves the country. And since national transfers are either free or extremely cheap, this is what allows TransferWise to apply such low fees. But behind this process, there's of course a complex proprietary technology belonging to TransferWise and everything works seamlessly. You don't wait or even know the path that your money is taking. You just know that your recipient in the other country receives the same amount with the correct current exchange rate and you pay very low fees for that. TransferWise takes care of everything in the background. So that's a genius way to bypass banks and allow people to send money abroad for the cheapest fee by doing two national money transfers instead of an international one. And speaking of bypassing banks, here comes another innovative business model block from TransferWise – customer relationships. In order to get new customers, TransferWise launches provocative advertising and PR campaigns against banks and their fees. For example, this ad and the text saying your bank is overcharging you on your overseas money transfers. But also this one and that one. Oh, and also a march in London where TransferWise founders and employees themselves walked in underwear in the streets with a tattoo, nothing to hide on their chests, sending people to a website where they explained everything. One can say that their provocative ad campaigns are unusual for a regulated financial company. And that's what makes the approach innovative. Because TransferWise is indeed regulated just like banks and other financial institutions. So it's absolutely safe to use it. Finally, since TransferWise maintains funds in their local banks in different countries, they made another innovation in the value proposition block, which is their borderless account and the debit card that goes with it. You can open an account which can receive euros, dollars, pounds and other currencies. And so when you use TransferWise MasterCard to pay for something in a certain country, the money will be withdrawn from the same currency if you have enough of it on your account. But if you don't have it, it will be converted from the most suitable other currency that you do have on your account using TransferWise low fees. So for example, if you are American and you go on a vacation in Europe or vice versa, this debit card will probably be the best option to use as a payment method. Typical bank fees are much higher for card payments in other countries, but TransferWise uses its own method and technology to provide ridiculously lower fees as stated on their website. If you want to learn more about business model innovation strategies from the best companies, check out my online course called Business Model Innovation – Differentiate and Grow Your Company. The link is in the description. This course helps both entrepreneurs and managers of big companies find innovative sources of growth and differentiation for their companies. You'll get plenty of examples like this. It's basically reverse engineering of successful innovation strategies. 
And while you're still here, do subscribe to my channel and click the bell button to be notified about my next videos about marketing and innovation hacks.